Hey and welcome. It's the 19th Sunday of Ordinary Time. The message today is one that challenges us on all levels once again. In fact, sometimes I think it's just too difficult. Jesus is really telling us and reminding us that where our heart is, is where the heart of our mission is going to be. That it's one thing to tell people what to do and how to live their lives, but it's a different thing when we try to lead them. We've had many leaders in our lives that tell us how we should live, tell us what we should be doing. But there are only a handful of people that truly lead us by their own example. And that's what Jesus is reminding us, that if we are going to be faithful disciples and call ourselves his followers, then that means that we have to do that by our actions. That we have to do it by the way we live our lives. We do that by the compassion that we show people, by the kindness that we give them, by the forgiveness that we can show in our own lives to people that have hurt us. That's the part that I find is really difficult. That's the part that is so challenging to me and I'm sure to many of you. When we look at who really great leaders are, great leaders are people whose mission continues on long after they're gone. And certainly we can say that about Jesus' mission. Jesus has left this world over 2,000 years ago, and yet his mission is still with us. His mission is all over the world, reaching out to those that are less fortunate, helping people that are not even Catholic, but because they want to raise the dignity of human life on all levels. My friends, that's the heart of this message today. And I invite you to be part of Church of the Nativity, a stewardship parish here in Midland Park, New Jersey. We want you to come and be with us and to help all of us continue this mission in our lives so that we too can be those great leaders in our own little way, in our own little corner here in Northwest Bergen County that will continue to spread out by works of charity, by the way we reach out to people that are less fortunate than us, and by the way we learn how to live with each other in peace and harmony and love and forgiveness. God bless you.